I honestly just can't stress this enough. But let me tell you something. You are moving and you are moving forward. Yes, you are moving forward. Oh, and by the way, you're watching me for the first time. I'm Ishmael and your priest and I welcome you to today's video. Listen, I know you've been hearing so many times that the Israelites, they will be trapped in the wilderness and God said it's time to move, get up and all these things. But I want to tell you that this actually everything, every event, and I think the Lord is taking to me. He's okay. He's been taking me to another deeper dimension of his way and how he works. That is why it is true. No matter how you can finally say, you know, God, as I read and finished the Bible multiple times, there were some things that you will only understand as time goes on. You cannot say that, yay, I've reached the limit. I now know the whole Bible. Yay, nothing is new. It's never like that. That is why you must also understand that you are moving forward. The Bible was, or the Old Testament was actually explaining how things were back then. You know what I'm saying? In some other ways, there were a time where they will be stuck. In life, there is a time where you are stuck. There's a time where you wait. There's a time where you just don't move. It's not a matter of oh, moving, 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 prospering, blessing, breakthrough, and everything is just praying, breakthrough, yeah, pray. nothing like that. There comes a time where you have to wait. There comes a time God waits for them to strike. There comes a time God says, ah, I'm going to do it next week. Like how we do as human beings, why are we, are we failing to also hear and be patient with our God? Someone today will say, after an interview, we're going to give it a response within, within the end of the month. And we're able to wait. Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir. And you're even obedient to listen to. But then, how much more with the God that you serve, our Father in heaven, when we pray, and you say, okay, don't worry, my son. Uh, I'm going to answer you before the end of the year. We feel like that is too much. Sometimes we don't even listen. Not because he's not talking, but we are not willing to listen. We want it now, now, now. But I want to tell you, as much as you might have been waiting, there is so surely a time where you have to move. God told Moses to move with the Israelites. They have stayed in the wilderness long enough. And the Bible makes it clear that they would have arrived earlier, but due to their disobedience and unwillingness to learn, it, they got delayed further. Let me tell you, you are moving forward right now. There is no more turning back. You cannot change sight. It cannot be reversed. When God says it is time, it is time. That is why it is no longer a matter of what your enemies are saying. When God says, yeah, it is time, it is time. You heard what I'm saying? When God says it is time, it is time. Say it to yourself. When God says it is my time, it is my time. When God says it is time, it is time. And it is my time and it is my time. I don't care what you have to say to me, Satan. I am moving, Satan. I don't care you, my enemies. I don't care what curse has been spoken against me. It is my time to move forward where God is leading me. And in Jesus' mighty name, I pray, nothing will stand in your way. I decree and I declare, in Jesus' mighty name, you are moving forward and you are making it big. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray once more. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.